should I have? I'm kind of tempted to just and just just have him kind of oh but he he's he's very square on the bottom so he doesn't quite fit gosh darn it I was hoping to like have him I really need to like cut out that microphone and have it in a different way <laughs> I could probably have him like peeking out somewhere else though. Just really tiny. He has ears, he's just his head's so far back. No, that doesn't work so well. Never mind. Make him huge. What we could do is just <laughs> This is how I stream. Yes, this is me. Uh and then How's that look? It's accurate, right? Borderline very accurate, I'd say. Have the mod icons covering the- Ooh, I could work on that. I could work on that. Pepper, DM me about that or else I'll forget. I can do that. Just the peachy mode in the corner. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of something else that would work better. Give me a second. You know what? This is this is this is today's stream, by the way, Loki. <laughs> Our stars do recommend. Yeah, let me get Ollie in on this action. Let's make it look like he's destroyed something. Oh, the pog champ changed. Oh heck yeah! Oh, I like that one too. It's facing a different direction. Okay, there's Ollie boy. And I can literally- oh, can I turn this? Okay, here, wait a minute. Uh, if I turn it by like- oh, that's the wrong way. Um, Give me a second, I'm not used to rotating things in this program. Give or take. <laughs> there we go. You're welcome. I'm so sorry. This is this is what you come to stream for, right? Oh my goodness, those squirtle emotes are adorable. I love them. There we go. This is, this is... Oh, really, Pepper? That's funny. This, this is what we come to stream for, right? <laughs> the content I signed up for. You still have the old guest on emote? Oh, that's a good question. I don't know if I do. Hey, Anna, how's it going? Oh, I love that tangy emote, too. Guys, what's your favorite emote at the moment? Post it in chat. If you have it. If you don't, then I'm sorry, but what's your favorite emote? Doesn't have to be one of mine. 100% does not have to be one of mine. I don't have the old guest on. Unless I put him in a different... Fo oh, here we go. I moved him. There's old guest on. Perfect. 
Oh, look at all these cute- I mean, <laughs> the Rosie zip file is amazing. <laughs> all these cute emotes. Present sleeper what face, yeah? Why should we add in Kiara? Not set to the streamer who has your favorite. I think mine. Oh, am I still sub to? Oh, my guess sub may have run out. No. Ah, uh, you guys know how I feel about um. Cafe Ella's rolled emote. It is one of my favorites. Um. I don't know. This one from Tiggs though is always top tier. Love the Feeny ones, but you're not subbed. <laughs> oh, goodness. Just woke up. What are we doing? We just finished Dream Towns for today. We got through eight of them, so I'm pretty proud. Um, we were playing around with the fact that I'm not on camera today. So someone redeemed Poof. So that came up, which is perfect. Um, but then uh, people were saying that we should put the emotes and stuff on camera. I think I'm good for now, Pepper. Hopefully. <laughs> um, but you know what we have to do? I have to change the title of the stream, actually. Let me do that before I forget. Oh, excuse you. And I just gotta change the title. There we go. Oh, really, Andrew? That's awesome. I've always wanted to this. How do you get to tier two and three on your emotes? Um, you mean how do you unlock those emotes? There's um, there's tier two and tier three subs, which cost extra. So it's more than just the normal subscription. Just use the screen when you don't have your camera on. <laughs> How long is the stream left? I'm not actually really sure, to be honest. I'm gonna try my best to um, go for full time, but we'll see. I love this though. This is chaotic and I love it. I'm here for it. <laughs> um, and I should probably also switch that off. We can get rid of that. And I'll switch the background to the proper one. There we go. Suddenly we're not dreaming anymore. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna get dressed really quickly because we are gonna be going outside and it is cold and snowy probably. Oh, what should I wear? I'm kind of feeling like a sweater today. Like, I'm not feeling like a sweater. I'm feeling like I should wear a sweater. Just want to make that, you know, known. <laughs> uh, what else do we got? No, see, I don't really know how I feel about those. Oh, but I, I do have these now too. Maybe I should go for one of these and just have like pants underneath. Wherever those are, give me a second. <laughs> uh, here they are. Oh, oh right, that changed. Oh, um, I'll go with that and I'll wear boots so it doesn't look like anything's going on. <laughs> No pants. My knees are gonna get cold. <laughs> Congratulations, Crystal has now evolved into sweater. You know it. Uh-oh, Pepper, what do you want me to wear? Now I'm scared. What do you want me to wear? Purple hoodie? Uh, this one? There we go. I think. What about for the bottom? Any preferences? This probably isn't it. 
purple leggings? Uh, I'm assuming you mean these ones. Shoes? Like those, to be honest. Okay, cool. And do you want a hat or no? Thorn has purple leggings, IRL. I only have black ones. <laughs> Wizard hat. Oh my goodness. Oh, I am so fancy. I'm assuming purple. Heck yes. I don't know what it is about this hat. It just looks really silly. <laughs> but I'm here for it. It's okay. Uh, do you have any preference on eyewear? Like Tim is asking or other accessories actually? You're a wizard crystal. She's perfect? Okay, thank you. Freedom. <laughs> do you guys want to see how weird this is going to be, by the way? Brace yourselves. Brace yourselves. Ooh, wings. I could go back and do that. Where's my path gone? Look at how weird this is. <laughs> I did a bit of- I did a little bit of work last night. Let me go back and add wings. Change, I know. Something we don't really do too well with. You have plaid leggings, they're so comfy. I've been meaning to look into getting some of those. I have plaid pajama pants on right now, they're comfy. Pumpkin patch is completely gone, yep. Oh, uh, wings, let's see. Like that? Okay. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, random. Yeah, the wings have a little bit jiggle fix to them for sure. Oh goodness. So yeah, I went through and I uh, started removing some things here and there. I haven't actually moved any houses yet, so that's probably something I should do today. Uh, also, I'll turn down that audio a little bit. Because I just realized I had it turned up for, um... Dream Towns. And, um... Should we go on another stretch break? It's only been like an hour. No, I think I'm alright. I think we're good. I didn't check the stocking. I didn't, Maggie. Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. It's gonna be weird to see it all flat. Yeah, it's definitely gonna be strange, that's for sure. I don't think I can actually check it with this in the way here. Thank you so much for that follow. Welcome on in. Hold on, there's something inside. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, could it be? Jingle's photo was inside. How sneaky of Santa. There we go. Yay, thank you guys for letting me know. I didn't know you could actually still get anything from the stockings. I, I thought that I had like missed it. And you know what? There he is. Very nice. <laughs> okay, back outside. <laughs> um, so yeah, I went through and I got rid of pretty much all of the custom paths except for ones like these that you actually can't get rid of, which is very annoying and I absolutely can't stand that they that they did that, <laughs> but that's just me. You, like, it, it won't go away. <laughs> Jiggle. <laughs> hey, Crystal, thanks for saying hi. I wonder if something fun will happen today. It could, any old second. Any time now. I'm so excited. Oh, this boy. 
we match in purple today. <laughs> Moving the past completely, yep. Paths are actually completely already gone, um, except for obviously the one that's still here. Um, I'm having major deja vu for some reason, that's really weird. Um, but yeah, I will be getting rid of these as well, um, just so that we have everything nice and flat. I'll also be digging in the rivers, moving all the flowers, and essentially leveling everything so we can have a nice fresh start. Yeah, it'll, I don't know if it'll be going today, but it's definitely going to be going. Uh, we're going to have to see. I think priority-wise... Oh, that's really awkward. Um, I've already started a little bit here, you can see, mainly because I had bushes. <laughs> Um, I need to earn some money so that we can, uh, move and, and remove some stuff. Character looks like mine. Oh! I just got- <laughs> someone dressed me today. One of my, uh, actually Pepper, she dressed me. Um, so I'm glad that we match. Also, I can finally hit these rocks again. Oh no, it's been so long since I've hit a money rock. Oh no, this is going well. One day, chat, I'll get it, don't worry. Oh. Oh, I thought that was first try, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, Lily Bell looks incredibly empty. And it's kind of sad because I'm, I'm a bit worried it's still gonna look empty like around festival time, whenever that starts. But I'm hoping we can, uh, we can get through it and uh, have somewhat of a pretty town by the time festival starts. Want to make a tiny snowman for fun and it's perfect apparently. Oh nice! That's awesome. I'm glad that it worked out. I've also started moving flowers as you can see. Oh my snowballs are in different places today for once. Go go for dinner. I'll be back after. No worries, Padfoot. Enjoy your dinner. Okay, let's go move the snowman over to my house. I don't usually get the chance to move them, so this is kind of exciting. Oh, you're new to Twitch. Well, welcome on in. I hope that you enjoy it. <laughs> okay, I gotta be careful. I don't roll this into the water. That would be very, very upsetting. <laughs> so Lily Bell 3.0 is probably going to be, I mean, I know it is going to be Stardew themed. Um, ah, Cloudy Wolf, I appreciate the rape. Oh, come on in. Or, I think that was rape. <laughs> I don't know why my thing always says host. Thank you for that. I hope that you uh, had a fantastic stream. What were you up to? No worries, Anthony. Enjoy your dinner. Um, but in terms of Lily Bell, I think the first thing I'm going to want to do is kind of make the entrance. I think entrance is really important. And then from there, we'll kind of work on the rest. Ooh, Dead by Daylight. Nice. I've been slowly being talked into getting that for myself. <laughs> Oh, what for today? Honestly, probably just... Excuse me. Excuse me. Gosh darn it. I'll leave it for two seconds. Um, we're probably going to be moving flowers as well as deciding which villagers to move first and which bridge and stairway to get rid of. Oh, were you playing New Leaf? Oh, that's a very different game. Uh, I hope that you had fun. Yeah, Pepper. I've watched a lot of Dead by Daylight, but not in a very long time. Mm, 
Ooh, something tells me I might not get this perfect. I'm gonna roll it over this way a bit. Make that a bit smaller. Mmm, maybe... Mmm, it's hard to tell. Oh, here we go, there we go, nice. Yay! Alright, Nate, we'll see you later. Aw, oh, no worries, Brandon. Got frozen table. <laughs> yeah, I always think I don't have it, Pepper, and then I actually make it. I'm like, oh wait, no, I do. I think I guess myself very hard on that. There we go. Nice. Did you like the tutorial you did on YouTube? Oh, yeah, like, um, masking, yeah. Is launching dead by daylight now. Aw, oh, have fun with it, Andrew. <gasps> Boots. We're gonna do a few hundred laps around the island. No big deal. You wanna come? Nope. <laughs> nope. I'm good, thank you. Why'd I put the brick path under the custom path? Because then it shows up on your map. If you just put down custom paths, you don't have paths on your map. And I, I low-key dislike that a lot. I like being able to see where I'm going on my map, so... Yeah. You like the lore, but you don't like playing the game itself. That's fair. Look at how empty this is. <laughs> Isn't this weird? Speaking of really liking the lore, don't like playing the game itself. That's me with, um, I was gonna say Bioshock, not Bioshock, uh, Five Nights at Freddy's as well. I keep thinking I'm, oh, I am hearing a balloon. Fragrance diffuser. Also, what am I getting messages about? Give me a second. FNAF is amazing. Oh, okay, that's just... Okay, cool. <laughs> um, Animal Crossing is better. I agree. I agree. Ah, uh, I haven't spoken to Patty yet. Hi. Oh my gosh, it's young and Hi. I love all the amazing discoveries I make on my walks, like cute flowers and places to hide things. What are you hiding? Glad to see you. Always good to see a friendly uh, face. Hope life is treating you alright. See, like, all the villager dialogue in this game, when they're talking to you, it's, like, usually just, like, greetings. You know what I mean? Like, they don't- or, like, weather talk. It's very, like, I don't know. It's not very deep conversation, maybe? An FVR was on sale too for the Switch, and I was so tempted to ask for it. When I thought about it, I probably won't actually play it, yeah. <laughs> Prefer watching other people get scared, such a mood. Guess what? I was playing single player hide and seek, and I won. I am so bored. <laughs> oh. Poor girl. So I think this area is pretty clear in terms of, um, uh, what do you call it? Fossils. Can I forget what I had answered some of the earlier villager questions? I had to look twice when Bluebear asked if I was still a pro at hiding bodies. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Jeremiah sent us a DIY for a water pump. We already know that one. 
Yeah, Ian, I definitely don't talk to my villagers in this game nearly as much. If I see them chatting to each other, that's when I talk to them. I'll try and say hello, though. Muscle madness. Woo! I heard chatting is a great way to work out the abs. I also heard my neighbors were complaining. I should probably actually start taking the flowers here, too. <laughs> Oh, can I not go around that way? I don't think I can. I think um, the exciting thing about redoing Lily Bell right now during the winter is that hopefully by the time the uh, the snow melts, we'll have like a really nice like farming themed town. Actually, I'll get out of that. I feel like they made villagers a cosmetic thing this game and not like a whole mechanism. Yeah, it's um... They definitely don't feel like the focal point like they used to and definitely some people like that, some people don't. Covering my entire beach update. Uh, instead of digging holes, I'm using weeds because it does the same thing as shovel but faster. Oh, that's a good idea, yeah. And uh, I think it's a little bit faster to pick them back up as well rather than like having to fill in the hole. To disappear the next day. That's cool to know. I usually don't leave any like out in the open, so that makes sense. I can't see if there's flowers back here. Oh, I guess there are. <laughs> Is that a rock? Oh no, that's an item. What was that? Oh, was that the that was the peach surprise box? That makes sense. You want the hard hat? Don't they sell hard hats in the store? Maybe they don't. Maybe I'm wrong. Boots just sat down. <laughs> oh, <laughs> thank you for clipping that, Maggie. I appreciate it. And so, Sherry, thank you for posting that in chat as well. I was wondering what you had clipped. I'm like, I don't remember anything happening. But, uh, yeah, that dung beetle was like, I found the ultimate snowball. <laughs> Block on the weeds. While holes, I'll have to cover it and dig it back up if I want to move around my beach. Yeah. Builders run around. Oh, yeah, like when they, like, Naruto run. Yes. <laughs> They're very cute. Trying mod you view, by the way. I think it's glitchy for DMs for some reason. Oh, yeah. More diverse even in Pocket Camp when talking to villagers. Yeah, I can't really talk much for Pocket Camp. I didn't play a heck of a lot, but that wouldn't surprise me. It kind of feels like with each game, it's gotten a bit less. Yeah, Pepper. I actually went into mod view the other day, just in passing. And I was just like, oh, this is intimidating. I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> Go on ad for Whataburger. Oh, goodness. <laughs> you don't mind it? That's good. Always handy to learn how to use new things like that. Or newer, I guess. Also, who in here participated in the fish tourney yesterday? And did you uh, get a trophy? If so, which one did you get? Did you bother? Did you forget? Because I know a lot of people did. Losing at Splatoon 2? Such a mood, right? I hope you're having fun, though. I hear a balloon. Ooh, 
There it is. Played for a bit, got enough points to the silver trophy. Nice. Tried did one round and stopped. <laughs> Plenty of dialogue. They just structured it poorly. You have to get through the greetings and recap of what you did yesterday, then the event talk, then they finally start to roll the majority of their lines. Yeah, and I think it's just because I don't talk to them repeatedly. That's why I don't see it. Maybe I should start doing that. Wow. I don't know about that game. <laughs> It is a lot more fun with friends, yeah. Yeah, Pepper, she sounds like a real weirdo. I'm sorry you had to sit through that. <gasps> Bob! Tomorrow's Maddie's birthday. Oh, <gasps> you saved my life. I did not know that. <laughs> I hope she likes my present. I got it for her a while back, then hid it in the floor for the bugs to guard. I got it out and it was full of... Oh, no. But it's okay. I talk to the bugs about respect and boundaries and all the other words I hear when I get in trouble. Oh my god. Who's telling my bob off? Who on earth are you telling him off? No one tells him off without me. Uh, oh, in January. I have a lot of January birthdays. We have Maddie, we had Bob, and we have Sherb. <laughs> Pepper. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to give her something. Played run by and switch back to Stardew. Uh, happy home designer, or happy home academy, sorry. Uh, and here are our trophies. Very cool. Wait. Oh, I forgot I ordered all these, right? Oh, yes, Tim, yes. I thought the points didn't accumulate over fishing 20 bugs off, so I played until I got all the rewards and all the trophies. Yep. Yeah, we were actually talking about people who did that yesterday. Um, how people were kind of ticked off that, like, you know, they grinded to get it, and... Like, you know, it in the end, it didn't really add up to anything. I mean, we still got it, but it makes replaying it not as fun, I guess. And then here's the trophies. We should go find a place for these in my house. <laughs> Pepper, she's just like, nah, it's, it's nice in here. I'm not gonna come out. Uh, I'm gonna put away this stuff for now, just cause I don't really know what I'm gonna do with it just yet. Yeah, and there was like no notice that that's what it was actually going to do. Um, I don't really know where I should put these. <laughs> that's actually true. You do make bells with them, so that's a good thing. I'll uh, replace the ones up there eventually. Fun fact, when I first saw um, this trophy shelf, I assumed you needed the trophies in order to build it, and I was really excited. I'm like, oh, that's such a cool use of them. And then you didn't, and I was kind of sad. First fishing tour, I was meaning to grind, but I had plans, so I wasn't spending the whole day in front of Animal Crossing. Yeah, I remember that fish first fishing tourney too. I streamed it. It was a lot of fun. That feels like so long ago. <laughs> Thinking back on that. So we're gonna have to go up and grab the flowers from this area here too. Playing with the new players and about it can be a little annoying watching me on the hook and not getting me down and de seeing themselves while they're on the hook. Oh yeah. distracted doing everything so that's my new thing to say <laughs> no Andrew I used to I mean I still watch him there's a streamer called Admiral Baru he has some really cute panda emotes um, but he played a lot of Dead by Daylight 
uh, when it was still pretty new, I think. And uh, he literally had this thing that uh, he would say whenever anyone DC'd, like purposely, like they left the game. And it would just be like, Ma, pull the cord, like the ethernet or internet cord. And I always thought that was really funny. Whenever I see someone DC purposely in a game, I'm just like, yeah, <laughs> that's exactly what you're doing. Uh, the pink mouse. Oh, um, I know Candy at Pink Mouse. I don't know anyone else, maybe. Yeah, Mandolin for sure. Speaking of watching someone play a game that, like, you know really well, but other people might not, um, I absolutely adore Dangerously Funny's videos for Stardew, but when New Leaf came out, he was doing New Leaf videos for a little bit, and I got really ticked off watching him. I'm just like, mm, no, no, <laughs> just no, all of this is wrong. Uh, it's, it's really funny how that can, that can really change your perspective. Yeah, for sure, Mendelin. He plays the way I imagine random plays. <laughs> I could see that. His commentary is fantastic, yeah. Dangerously funny. If you have not seen um, him, he is on YouTube and he does uh, a lot of like, oh, I don't want to say like management games. He kind of like, he tends to break games. It's so, like Stardew, he'll go out of his way to make his most the most money or like, you know, do all these really silly things in order to break games. It's very, very amusing. Yeah, I've avoided that video on the Stardew update just because I don't want to be spoiled for stuff, but... I think I'm hearing another balloon, but I think I always hear a balloon in this area. Oh no, I am actually hearing a balloon. a lot of those today. Oops. Oh, no, never mind, got it. <laughs> oh no, Walker. Oh, uh, I think I already have that one. Gosh darn it. Well, I can give it to someone who might need it later, I guess. Always happens to me whenever I see my sister play Super Mario Maker 2, I'm like, no, that's not how you do it. Yeah. I always try and keep my mouth shut though, to be fair, especially if it's like someone who I'm actually physically with. Um, you never want to tell anyone else how to play. Cannot wait for the Stardew update to come out on Switch. I know, I know, it's so exciting. Uh, I might start another like private playthrough off stream on my Switch when that happens. Just because I have a lot of good luck on Switch for some reason. Thank you so much for that follow, by the way. Oh, Mendelin, was I? I want to ask chat something. I have this uneven spot on my island. I want to make a f it forest themed. What do you guys add in a forest area? Maybe cliffs? Cliffs? Uh, the mushroom furniture if you have any. Uh, depending on what sort of forest. Maybe a little bit of bamboo in there. Um, just lots of like stuff littering the floor I feel like. Leaf piles if you have any. No, I was definitely tabbed out. <laughs> Uh, I think I have- actually no, I know I have Hylian on an auto host, so I know I hosted, um, Water Mom yesterday, which was nice. Um, and then after that I think it must have gone to Hylian. No worries, no worries. Uh, okay, so this area is good. New Sims 4 pack in two days. Is that the ghost one? Max was telling me all about that last night because I've been obviously very behind on the sim stuff. 
That's cool. That's cool. He was telling me a bit about it. And I'm like, oh, that's kind of interesting. Something about being able to play as the Grim Reaper. Or maybe that's a joke. I'm not sure. Either way, it looked cool. Uh, fossils back here? No. Doesn't look like it. Yay, have my soul. <laughs> oh, goodness. Ah, uh, we might watch KK. I'm not sure if we'll time travel forward or not. So many games I want to play so little time. I, uh, I've just been really, really enjoying Final Fantasy IX recently. Other than that, I've been very just like, you know, I've been enjoying playing my games on stream and then I have my one game off stream and I'm doing pretty good with that. And Stardew, of course. <laughs> Make sure there's nothing back here. Okay, this looks pretty good. You got online school tomorrow? Oh, hopefully it goes well. We are going to be playing Bugs next tomorrow. And, oh, thank you so much for the follow. I'm not sure if we're gonna be finishing or not, but I'm kinda just, I, I absolutely love that. Oh, did you read something shocking? <laughs> His eyes changed for a second. What's up? All right, Maddie's birthday is tomorrow. Are you ready? I've got the whole scene mapped. I'll hand over my gift and Maddie will be like, ugh, but like a good act. Like, and oh my gosh, this is the best ever act. I think I mispronounced that the first time, but that's okay. Online school scare anyone else? I think I'd much prefer it to be honest, but I'm also like just shy IRL, so. And having his own picture up in his house is still one of my favorite things. He's so sassy and I absolutely love him for it. <laughs> Watch a lot of catch up on YouTube, keep forgetting this is live. Oh no, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, that happens quite a bit. Oh, was Ed in your campsite a while ago? What was he doing there? He's meant to be staying here. <laughs> Adapted well to online classes. So they're pretty good for me, but I've always been focused organized student. Yeah. Um, people who maybe aren't as... Uh, organized or maybe even self-motivated because that's a big thing with online learning um they definitely might be having a bit more of a rough time streaming story season so he felt replaced oh maybe gosh darn it <laughs> that tree's gonna annoy me College where professors have discretion rather than a school system in high school or below. Yes, yeah. Yeah, I, uh, especially for like little kids, right? Like having to sit down like a six year old in front of a computer and be like, all right, you're learning here is like just. That's gonna be hard. <laughs> Oh, Maggie, better get it done. I think I keep missing a flower. How am I doing this? What? Did I actually get it? Oh, it's a- oh, I'm so dumb. <laughs> it's on the upper layer. Very true, very true, Andrew. Okay, let's go put these away. I'm really proud of this little area. I might make another thing very similar to that in our Stardew Town.
One day of school a week and work the rest as part of my apprenticeship and keeping up with online school has been so hard, especially since they only send us worksheets. I have to teach us everything by ourselves. Yeah, on top of working. Yeah, that's definitely stressful. For sure. Online school work isn't hard to be honest. Just give you a lot, so you, I prefer having a lot more work, but less. Oh yeah. I um. I took one online course when I was in college, just one. Um, I don't think I could find a good time slot for it for the rest of my schedule, and it was one of the last courses I needed, so I took it, and. Uh, it was it was interesting. It was interesting. Um, I felt it was much more straightforward, but it also gave you so much wiggle room. They essentially assigned a project at the very beginning, told you to read these pages of the book, and then present it uh, over a phone call at the end. And it was like it was really weird. Oh, you got Big Top in your campsite? Nice. The superhero villagers are really cute, yeah. Hey, Anthony, welcome back. We've just been tidying around town. I've been slowly doing dailies while doing this, though. I remember something about reading books in colleges. You don't read them. Yep. <laughs> it was a... I took... It was a marketing course, actually. Um, and it was very, very straightforward, so I didn't really read most of it. If I remember correctly, I actually have to... I think the, the, the final assignment of that marketing course was I had to pitch a product that didn't already exist, but could be an alteration of something. So I did... Uh, thin Oreos. No. Something like that, although I don't think that they were in stores here at least at the time. I know that they're a thing now. Um, and at the end of it, he's like, alright, how much do you want me to give you, like, monetary-wise for my backing? And I'm like, I blanked. I'm like, I have no idea what money means anymore. <laughs> Game professors that don't lecture. Oh, yeah. I invented thin Oreos. You know it. It was funny, though. <laughs> um, I think I saw them in stores a while later, and I'm like, oh, that's weird. I'm gonna have to leave the ones around the tree, unfortunately. And yeah, Tim, they are. They are. I've heard that before. She's a large snowflake for an expert snow sculptor. You might think every snow person has a huge collection of these, but they're actually hard to come by. Thank you. I'm not learning by reading, I'll learn by making my projects and homework. Yep. <laughs> Oh, I hear another balloon. We're getting a lot of those today. Which, you know, I'm not complaining about, but... I could have got these when I was, uh... hunting for them the other day. I like doing college online because I can go at my own pace, I thought. Uh, it was gonna be hard due to having learning disabilities. I've actually improved as a student with my online classes. That's really good, yeah. Um, and I know, at least for me, um, I traveled uh, about two hours to go to my college. Hour and a half to two hour trip uh, there and then that same mount back. So having that extra time as well when I did take that online course was really nice because I didn't spend it commuting. How many balloons have I popped so far? Uh, what's the name of the thing called? Do you know? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, 
there any treasure? I mean, well over 300. So, <laughs> uh, I, I don't know about it anymore, but at one point I was over 300. Yeah, Ian, of course. Yeah, we got the golden slingshot. I never use it because I hate that they break, so I just make a point of not using the golden tools, but I do have it. I'm kind of really liking that new pog champ again. Yeah, Bunny Day really amped up how many you could get, so. I think under the t at the time, though, I was under the impression that they didn't count towards that. I could be wrong, though. In fact, I know I probably am. <laughs> it's kind of weird seeing all my flowers stacked up like this. I didn't think I had that many, but I still have a heck of a lot to dig up, so... Whenever I need a golden slingshot, I got time trouble. <laughs> to bunny day. <laughs> Just make use of it. Yeah, I, I know I had a heck of a lot more before. But I think I had people helping me move them, to be honest. I don't... I think I'm fine right now. I can always bother you guys later <laughs> if I need help, but... Foot. Welcome back. Did you, Anthony? Awesome. Uh. Okay, so these ones are gonna be probably moved last. There's so many of them. I feel like I'm missing a fossil, but I guess four is the proper amount. I've been getting five recently. <laughs> Let me go see what you sent me. Actually, I'll sell these and then I'll do that. <laughs> Maggie, enjoy your dinner. We'll see you later. Yeah, Knuckling, it is really, really nice to like have just this big flat island to uh, work from. It feels very, um, refreshing, maybe? Goes with my outfit. Ooh! I'm intrigued. Uh, that I can move. Or get rid of. What should we give Maddie for her birthday, you guys? Isn't Fauna the cutest in those glasses? I really like that match. <laughs> or that, uh, um, accessory, maybe. Oh, you're looking at that? I could liven up my home decor as an amp. I don't know if that would go with your theme, girly. Uh, we do indeed, Max. We do indeed. Thanks to Straw Cherry. I really like that one. There we go. Okay, um, I don't think I really want to give her anything in here. I'm gonna go through the items in my house and see if I had anything that I wouldn't mind gifting her. Get her a cocoa poster. Oh no. 
Hey, Kiara Cat, you're finally waking up, huh? She's looking so tired. <laughs> every cliff and river on one of my island resets and it took me literally a week to get everything flat and then I had no idea what I could do. Oh no. Ooh, grape. Is it a, is it a grape hat? Is that a thing in this game? Uh -huh. I look like Fantasy's cousin and I don't know what I'd be called. <laughs> Uh, I'll have to think of a name. Because we have Scurvy and Fantasy and there was another one, I can't remember her name. Tango. There must be something for Grape. We'll think of something. <laughs> Fantasy. Just grape jelly. One name, but it's not Twitch friendly. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm intrigued. Jello. Oh, that actually works really well. Okay, let's put away stuff I don't need at the moment. Should we give Maddie? We have so much extra stuff in here. Uh, oh, I already got it. I'm never gonna use the pink books, but it suits her perfectly. That's not how you do that. <laughs> oh, offline, I don't think I have, unfortunately. Oh, Walker, yeah, that's a lot of doggos. <laughs> Okay, there we go. So that is that sorted. Let's start. I'm gonna need more shovels. Start moving these flowers. I'm gonna forget what each villager had around their house. Oh, speaking of more shovels. You can kill roaches in this game by dropping furniture. Oh, I didn't know that. I don't think I've gotten roaches. Maybe I have once, actually. No, I saw that in a dream town. Never mind. Oh, yeah, Anthony. That will get banned, yes. Or blocked, at least. You did, and you laughed for a good minute. <laughs> Do you guys think we'll ever get an upgrade for Nook's Cranny? Do you guys think that's something they have in store for us, or do you think this is always going to be the final... Oh, bless you, Kiara. The final upgrade. You don't think so, Andrew? You think we're going to have TNT Emporium eventually one day, Ant? Oh, you don't think so. Yeah, I kind of... I could see them adding something maybe later, but I don't think it's going to be like anytime soon. Watch as the next update's like, oh, by the way. This will upgrade somehow, it'll end up worse. <laughs> like an upstairs. Yeah. Oh, is there Tim? God, what am I hitting? Oh. What am I- what? There we go. <laughs> Jeez. Just want Brewster and Cabin. I still think Cabin could- should come by the docks every now and then. I don't know what he'd do, but I just want him to come by and say hi. We added retail as the second floor where you could ask Cyrus to- <gasps> Ooh, I love that idea. Kinda love that idea. So you wouldn't have to wait to get the other furniture colors or go to someone else's town even. 
Kara, are you trying to get underneath that blanket? I was wondering why she was staring at me. She was waiting for me to lift her blanket up so she could burrow underneath. <laughs> there we go. Sell exotic fruits. Oh, he could. He could bring out special things, maybe. I was actually thinking of, like, the, um, the night market in Stardew. Where, like, there's people who come on ships and stuff. Who may lift very soft and warm textile, please. <laughs> Essentially, Kiara, I guess. I remember people asking me when we- I, I distinctly remember people talking to me about this when we were playing, um, that fruit maze minigame in New Leaf during stream and people would be like, oh, Crystal, do you think they're gonna have, like, you know, the exotic fruits? And I'm like, it's an island, of course they're gonna have exotic fruits. They didn't have exotic fruits, chat. <laughs> I still can't believe they did that. I feel like maybe instead of recent sours, it'd be a new pave. Ooh. I don't know how I'd feel about them replacing pave, though. Not replacing, but like, you know. Pave is so unique. <laughs> hey, Alfie, how's it going? Welcome on in. It was your fault on subs. <laughs> I think the extra doors in the museum will be booster. Yeah, there is extra space in there. Just weird that they had recent Cyrus and Leaf, only to not bring them back. It does seem really strange, because as far as I know, they were popular villagers or characters. want to be a separate building I see I know that I can just change around my island if the new buildings won't fit in but it's also more work so am I hearing more balloons maybe I'm not Don't want any more island buildings unless they give us more space. Yeah, I don't know how like they work that in. Yeah, Walker, if you want to. Oh, hi, Kiara. <laughs> I don't know if that picked up. Hope Nintendo has some good stuff for us because we waited for a new Animal Crossing game for so long and I see not just so much hype and new players last year. Yep. I hope that they keep it rolling as well. Um, I'm excited. I've uh, been kind of checking Twitter every morning before stream, just like keeping an eye out for any potential uh, updates because I know that we're supposed to be expecting one towards the end of January, I think. Uh, heading into February at least. And I've been like waiting for that announcement <laughs> so we can watch it on stream together. Yeah, you never know, Andrew. I could see him like having like a traveling card or something. Like another island or another city, yep. I could see them doing that too. You think sometime next week? Oh uh, yeah, I have my scene set up for it so we can watch it all together and I'm really excited. <laughs> is the other roost? I'll have to rework Jitter's yard since his yard is the roost construction site. Oh dear. I 
Yeah, Walker, feel free. For the roost music, you know what, now that you mention it, the music for the roost would probably sound really pretty. If the other New Horizons soundtracks that have been... Or Animal Crossing soundtracks that have been brought into New Horizons or any indication. Kiara, I'd really appreciate it if you stop rubbing your little face on the microphone, please. I don't know why you like doing that. <laughs> What kind of renovations are you doing that you got to put all your flowers on the beach? I'm actually going to be flattening the island entirely. Um, and we're going to be making it into a Stardew theme town. So we're just doing a new theme, pretty much. I swear to god, I'm hearing a balloon. Oh, I am. Hello. Sounds good, Walker. Bev's a little bit too close to the camera. Bev's not used to streaming just yet. He's getting there. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really excited to see how it works. Gosh darn it. <laughs> um, I'm hoping that we can make it look like an island where you, when you first visit, you recognize it as Stardew for people who have played. That's kind of like the end goal is someone can walk in and be like, oh my god, wow, I recognize that. How's it going? And Sandra, welcome on in. How are you doing today? from everybody's chat for just saying knock knock something tells me most people wouldn't ban for just that <laughs> was there anything else going on at the time maybe sure my sister she said oh is that bob and i was like who's bob that's bev <laughs> filling up this beach you guys <laughs> send help <laughs> too many flowers not enough beach declined it. Oh well. I don't know who uh, whose channels they're talking about and to be honest I don't really want to know because it's it's your business with them not mine. We can't do anything about it. Um, but yeah. Oh Rosie okay they see there you go that explains it. <laughs> Thank you. Bruce tuck his antlers into his hat. Now that's dedication. See, that's my only thing about villagers that have like uh, horns and and stuff like that, like Julian and and uh, I guess Eric, other villagers. Like it's it's strange that they seem to suddenly don't have those anymore. Oh man, that tea though. Thank 
thank you so much for that follow. Nah, it's all good, Rosie. I need, uh... I need some more tea in my life. My throat's been acting up. <laughs> Sandra, we are, we are. Oh, you know what I forgot to do this morning? Huh? I forgot to upload the town tour. It is up. It's up for patrons already. Uh, I'll upload that after, um... Or finish uploading it after stream today. Um... But yeah, we, uh... We are officially getting ready to, uh... Bring Lily Bell down and, and uh... Introduce the Stardew theme. Which is gonna be slow going, but that's okay. <laughs> Walk past Molly's house and three villagers just in her garden looking at the windows. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of mine trees. I wasn't sure what to put back there, so I just started planting those. Um, I can use the money from that to move houses. I'm smart. <laughs> every once in a while I have a good idea. It's not very often. But every once in a while. Are we set? I'm going for Harvest Moon Wonderful- <gasps> Yes! Wonderful Life theme! Your old playthrough uh, has given me lots of inspiration for my island. I wish you all the best with that. That is one of my favorite games, as you probably know. I, uh... I, I suddenly have a whole bunch of ideas on how you're gonna do that, and I'm really excited. I put down my trees for like special days or whenever and never shake them. They're kind of for memories. That's a really cute idea. Well, leave my answer is the same as the mods. Depends. <laughs> Chat New Horizons got clogged up for a bit. So if you're interested in seeing the cafe area made for Bruce, you'll have to scroll up. Oh no, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Also, there's a really big fish over here, low-key, and I kind of want to know what that is. It, actually, maybe it's not that big. Let's see, can I catch this? I think it's a sea bass. Now, that would be sad if it was, because <laughs> it's in the wrong area, but I guess we'll see. Sandra, they did indeed. Aha! Uh -huh. It's, um, it's the minister person that Random was talking about yesterday. <laughs> oh, there goes my fishing rod. <laughs> the Forget Me Not Valley map, but definitely gonna recreate a lot of the areas. I think that sounds good overall. Not even just like the map, just having memorable spots is gonna be really nice. Scottish minister. <laughs> Aw, Sandra, no, it's all good. Yeah, that fish was so big it actually broke the rod. You got three sturgeons yesterday? Nice. I feel like a lot of people caught really big fish for the um, fishing tourney and I just kind of <laughs> didn't, but that's okay. Just noticed the camera. <laughs> Beb's first stream. No, oh, welcome on in. <laughs> um, or welcome on into Beb's stream, I should say. Um, we were joking about what I should have on camera instead. Cut 
caught two or fish in a row in the spring tourney while I was trying to get the trophies and dice. Where am I? I am probably hanging out in the void right now. I'm not really sure. Oh, there goes my shovel. Took my hair out of the braid. I've kept them in for two days and now I'm, <laughs> now I'm a cloud. <laughs> Red, thank you. In the Kingdom Hearts void. <laughs> yeah, maybe I have become Beb, actually. Maybe I'm inside the void that is Beb. Although I just realized I've been using this, like, Bob image since before Beb was a thing, but we just all automatically are just like, yeah, that's Beb. <laughs> you are Beb, let's be honest. <laughs> Stuffed crust pizza, heck yes, nice, dude. Are you still playing that game from last night? It does have bed vibes for sure. Oh. Okay, indestructible flower. There we go. <laughs> Fingers crossed, Eric. Yeah, the bot's its own bot person. <laughs> you want me to redeem it? I think I redeemed it once, actually. I can't remember. But uh, if I remember, I will. go that's that beach filled up you're getting do you know moon jumping vibes in chat oh goodness me but have you heard about the moon jumping though sushi it was yes it was it's it's slowly being torn down now but it was at one point yep yeah. if anyone in here maybe is newer and doesn't know what I'm going on about with moon jumping. Um, I was playing Breath of the Wild uh, last year and I had a whole bunch of people come in uh, who really knew that game, which is awesome. It's always fun to chat with people who know it. Uh, but that game I had a heck of a lot of backseating compared to normal and I had one person who came in who was just adamant about moon jumping. I think it's some sort of thing you can do to glitch Breath of the Wild so you can go flying across the map. Exactly, it was just like that. And they were very, very adamant about it. And it was... You kind of meet people. You meet a lot of people on Twitch. <laughs> Whether you're chatting or streaming, you meet a lot of people. Oh, Rai, did you... Did it not go through? Rai, when did you uh, redeem it? Because I saw that someone else redeemed it just now. Thank you so much for that follow. I appreciate it. Oh, that's really awkward, Mendelin. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this this person just it, it, they were memorable. Put it that way. <laughs> it was fun. Yeah, right. You may have uh, you may have it may have just gone at the exact same time as sushi rolls. So it, it chose sushi rolls and then redeemed yours.
Oh, time to smash, really? <laughs> that's beautiful. No, that's all good. I just wanted to make sure we didn't, like, miss it. Which building do you guys think I should move first? I'm guessing probably one of the ones up on this layer. Oh, Josh with the seven month resub. I appreciate that. Thank you so very much. Welcome back. I hope you've been well. I'm sorry, we're having a very, very like low key chill stream today. I'm feeling under the weather. But I hope everything's good with you. Is there a clip of the moon jumping? Um, so I don't remember any clips and I don't remember what episode it was. But I do know that I was in the desert area and I was around these columns at the time that the moon jumping person was like really on my case. General shop, museum. The museum is the largest one, yeah. Um, and for removing a public works project, I think I'll get rid of the... Uh, ramps leading up to the uh oh wait actually you know what no i'll get rid of bridges first those are easier to deal with hey phil how are you doing It's just the water that's getting me. Hopefully. I don't see anything. <laughs> My Hero Academia. Uh, I know of it. I think Mike might watch it. I haven't seen very much of it, though. I did, Phil. I did. I hope you're having a good day. <laughs> uh, last time you played Wind Waker and you've been watching on YouTube since before memory. Oh my goodness, yeah. That's quite a while. <laughs> days it's okay I haven't done anything interesting oh <laughs> now random redeemed it there we go <laughs> I'm not going to be coming over to your island or anyone's island today. I'm just, uh, tidying up my own. Oh god, Walker. <laughs> Thinking back on it now, that's so long ago. Sure, Lily, sure. I see how it is. Who do you guys think they're talking to? Rocket, I'm sorry about that. The bot's alive. The bot's very, very much alive. <laughs> oh, I'm... I just dug up your flower. I'm sorry. Oh, the sass. <laughs> the cold shoulder as he walks away. Oh, Cecily, she's already setting up our binders for next semester. Well, you know what? It's always ready to be prepared rather than panicking on that last night, right? How are you just gonna dig up his flower like that? I feel guilty. <laughs> oh. 
It's okay, he'll forgive me. Maybe I should send him that flower in the mail later. Oh, Mendel, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. How much of Bugs Nice is left? Enough for fish tomorrow. Um, you know what? I'm hoping kind of that we don't finish it tomorrow. Uh, but I'm really, really not sure. Exactly, Andrew, exactly. So I've messed up for spring semester, but can't until I found out if I got into my program or not. Oh, yeah. That's stressful. Yeah, we've been playing a game called Bug Snacks. It's really, really silly and ridiculous, but it's so good. Ron's having a proper meteor shower. Oh, nice! They're really, really pretty. Kiara's snoring again. <laughs> I don't know if she's just like has a blocked nose or something. What's the gist of the game? Yeah, so uh, you're traveling to an island and you play as this like, I think you're some sort of like journalist. And you're invited to this island where apparently all the creatures kind of look like a, mer a mix of bugs and snacks. It's like there's like a sandwich bug and stuff like that, or a burger. Um, and uh, there's a whole lot of mysteries going on there. And uh, you're kind of tasked with solving it and getting to know the people. It's really, really ridiculous. What's up, Walker? Hashtags. We need to live for my entire beach. Oh, and it doesn't work. Do the uh, do they come up through the weeds? Like what happens? Yeah, bug snacks. It's a very difficult game to explain for sure. Um, I'm very glad that I, I picked that one up. And actually, there's been a lot of games like that recently, where. Um, I've just been really, really happy that I decided to stream it and I got to experience it with you guys and it's like, you know, Spirit Fair being one, Bug Snacks being the other. I'm hoping that we find a lot more games kind of like that that are maybe on the shorter side uh, to play for 2021. Do you time skip? Not really, no. If I do, it's like to nighttime when I'm not usually streaming so that we can see KK, but I'm not going to do that today. Uh, let's see. Okay, good. Wait, are we onions now? Are we ogres too? What's happening? I feel like I've missed something in chat. Hi, I'm Daisy! Okay, Daisy's still Daisy. Daisy's not an onion. So that's good. Oh, is it? <laughs> Pepper?
Wait, random. I'm a bit concerned about the second word in that sentence. Mario. Just watch the part where he's telling you to do so much. Yeah, it was fun. I'm still not 100% sure if he was trolling, but it was still a fun time. Probably was. I have no clue, Sandra. <laughs> Rocket, well, I'm glad that you're enjoying it. Oh, whoops. Gosh darn it. Me trying not to die in Skull Cavern while keeping up the chat. Oh, more power to you. Can't relate. Yeah, Anthony, we have a new emote. We're totally redesigning it, Stained by the Sea. I'm very excited. Um, we're still in the moving stuff phase, but I'm very, very excited to like level it and then just start fresh. See what we can do. Hashtag smooth. I like green onions too. make a forest island or a city island. Ooh, I've noticed that a lot of people when they do like city themed islands they tend to lag especially if they have a lot of um, like the billboards and stuff like that. Um, forest islands I find less likely, sorry, less likely to lag. But in like I don't know they seem a bit more natural to do for Animal Crossing. I don't know. They're both really cool themes. Simple panels that's the word thank you. <laughs> I was like I can picture them in my head, but I don't know what they're called. That was weird. Much appreciated. Like how Bob's just vibing. <gasps> Another balloon. Oh, it's a really obnoxious place. I'm pretty sure that would land in the water. Uh, you know what? Never mind. It's probably not a new DIY anyway. <laughs> oh, that is definitely not how you dig up something. There we go. Are you setting your villagers to this island or would it be villager hunting? Oh, definitely. Um, if Bruce asks to move out, we're 100% villager hunting. Ed and Jillian as well. Um, theoretically, I'd like villagers to go with the Stardew theme, but I'm kind of a bit wishy-washy on that. Um, so horse, pig, sheep, cows. Chickens, ducks, dogs, and cats would all be cool. <laughs> Gaston, Gaston would be fun to have again, maybe. We'll have to see. We do already have Bob, so. Ooh, wait a minute, they're talking. I love these conversations. Hello? Muscular timing. We were just trying to figure out how to show everyone what an awesome place Lily Bell is. Yep, dancing is super hot right now, so I want to jump up uh, on stage and do a big dance show. I'll totes wow the whole crowd. Rod, you're one of my backup dancers, okay? What? You're kidding, right? We're gonna put on a weightlifting competition. You're gonna be my spotter. Um, no. Weightlifting? Nuh uh. I'm supposed to be in the spotlight, not spot ting. If anything's gonna be in the spotlight, it should be my mega muscles. Hey, you got to be our tiebreaker, Crystal. What do we do? Uh oh. Uh oh, chat. 
Weightlifting or dance show? Pick Rod? <laughs> Neither? Okay, so two for Rod, uh, one for Patty so far. Two for Patty. Three for Rod, two for Patty. Four. Three, jump in the river. <laughs> alright, alright. Weightlifting, I guess. You got- oh, she shook her head! You got it, muscles always bring the crowds. Lily Bell's gonna go muscle mad. Alright, now that that's settled, time for a flex. <laughs> Okay, you want to put muscles in the spotlight? You got it. I'll totes out- outlift everyone. <laughs> Check out my flex. <laughs> I like how I'm clapping. <laughs> what a weird conversation. This is why I always go and listen to my, uh, my villagers when they're chatting together. Them be fighting words. Their conversations together are, like, the best thing. What's happening? I don't even know. <laughs> Thank you so much for that follow. I appreciate it. I was about to buy another fishing rod. <laughs> yeah, Rosie, so do I. It's kind of sad. We got a bit of a hammock in today. I think I might already have that one. Or similar, at least. Do you guys think someone would be willing to pick up all my weeds on my beach on Nukazan? <laughs> um, maybe. Depending on what you're willing to offer them. Villagers have really sweet and friendly combos. Fauna always talking about gifting the other villagers. Oh, Fauna is such a good girl. It was weird the other day, you guys. I was watching an older clip uh, from when I was still playing um, New Leaf, and I saw myself pick up a flower without my shovel, and I felt super uncomfortable about it. Like it didn't go the way you think it would go, because you're so used to New Leaf now. I or New Horizon, sorry, I guess. And uh, I think that's going to be an issue if I do go back to New Leaf, or when I do, is I'm going to be constantly digging things up. <laughs> I need to dig up and destroy my flowers the day I go back to New Leaf. <laughs> or at least, you know. Wanna hear a spooky story about Beb? Sure. Why not? Okay, so I need to start picking up trees here as well. Watching uh, Jeff play Wild World and notice Wild World has a dialogue that asks a lot what you think of the, that villager. Like the last what you. They'll ask if you think they brushed their teeth that day, or how mean you think they are. It felt more personal, yeah. For sure. I could see that. Oh no, Walker, did you? No, it's all good. <laughs> Whenever I see that, I always just assume I'm reading it incorrectly, to be honest, so. It's all good. I really like this little entrance area that we made as well. Okay, oh, smell got low, how's it going? Welcome on in. Thank you for that follow. And really, hello, how are you doing today? Welcome on in. If you guys are just joining us, we are currently in the middle of picking up all of my flowers and moving them down to the beach. We're gonna be uh, 
kind of terraforming my town and changing it into a Stardew themed town, but it's not going to look anything like that for the moment. Day he was moving into my town, he said that Chief wanted to move because the island's clouds. Yes. <laughs> I've seen that dialogue before and I was always just like, what? Oh, what? Is that place not suitable? Oh, there was always something there. Never mind. It is a cute username. <laughs> um, actually, wait a minute. No, I'll continue with this area. Testa B, she's a dog. I've never had her before, but her catchphrase is bingo. My mom babysits. It's a nursery line. Bingo plays a lot. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. She's a cute villager, too, if she's the one I'm picturing. I think I might actually change my flag next time I get around to it. Do something for Stardew. The limited edition Animal Crossing Switch is on Amazon again. Need to keep telling myself I don't need it. I don't need it. Yep. <laughs> I know it's very, very tempting. It's very cute. Oh, wait a minute. I actually can't do anything up here. Sitting watching the stream in the same position for almost four and a half. Ooh, god. Yeah, no nibbles, you better <laughs> get yourself a quick stretch break or something in there. You don't want to get all stiff. What's up, Pepper? Uh, Robert, probably not this time. If I find I have a lot of spares after, um... Aw, oh, thank you so much for the follow. If I find I have a lot of spares after, um... After the, uh... The renovation, then for sure. But for now, I'm not planning on it. Okay, now Star Trek is laughing, so I'm a bit concerned. I'm gonna go check the bot on Discord. I don't trust you guys. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Good to know. I see you guys. <laughs> uh huh, sure, sure, sure. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Father bought me the Nixie Switch when it restocked in September, and it's my life. I'm resetting my island on there because I have a new island theme, and the map layout just wasn't my ideal. I didn't reset it because I had Renee and Dom. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm from Canada. I'm from Canada, yeah. Actually, wait a minute. Maybe I should get rid of this before I go down. I'm just gonna take my fancy grey pad off, but that's okay. There we go. That's better. And a lot quieter. Ooh, Rosie, do tell. Uh, the villager? Yeah, she's really cute. I've only really had her, I think, the one time. Yeah, feel free, Rosie. Uh, Rosie's adventures with Sunny. As much as kittens are cute, I'm kind of happy we didn't have Ollie as a kitten because he would be the biggest terror. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, Italy. Well, that's really cool, though. So, if you guys weren't here yesterday, and if, if you know Stardew, you'll probably know what I'm talking about. But my plan for right in this area here is that, like, big walkway that's between your house and Stardew and the town. Uh, and I already have, like, the fence idea in mind, and I'm really excited for it, so. Uh, Pepper, what am I looking at? Did she drag the garbage can? What is happening? Whitney? Whitney's a cool villager. <laughs> well, that's a new habit. I wonder if she's trying to get into it, Rosie. Kind of want Stardew, but I don't know if I should get it on Switch or on my PC. Uh, are you more likely to want to mod it, or are you just going to play vanilla, do you think? Because I'd say that's the main difference. <laughs> pretty much, Robert. Pretty much. Sunny's been now. <laughs> Dragged into the middle of the room, because why not? I know, Rosa, you're four paper towels. Never used mods or anything on a game, but I think PC because now I know that I can use mods finally. Yeah. If you're gonna want to, it's a good idea. If not, then Switch is really nice for Stardew. Uh, and we got. Ooh, nice. There we go. So we'll have our uh, our little walkway going both ways. And hopefully it'll look good. <laughs> Drifting or anything on the switch? Yeah. Thank you so much for that follow. I appreciate it. Okay, time to start harvesting some of our bell trees because I do want to start demolishing and moving things. Yeah, sushi rolls. That's totally fair. Even today with modding, like, I'll do very basic ones. I don't really get into it too heavily, so I can still enjoy vanilla every now and then. I'm sorry to interrupt your workout. My goodness. Uh, I feel bad. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's talk infrastructure. And bridges and climbs. And demolish something. I actually heard it that time. Hopefully that wasn't too loud. I did turn down the volume of that. Uh, we're gonna get rid of this bridge, I think. Ah, uh, Walker, if you're curious, you could do exclamation mark stardew mods. I actually do have a list of them, um, and it does have a quick description of what each of them does as well. I'll, I'll forget if I say it off the top of my head, that's all. <laughs> Uh, and then again, I want to move the museum. Poor fathers, I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> You're the first one to move. I just realized I can have all the trash cans and everything around the houses. Because they have that Hi, in Stardew. Daisy. Hi, Daisy! Oh, no, no. I don't want to move the bridge. I'm demolishing it. So that's good. 
Did it not go through? Wow. Really? Oi. Huh. Let me try again. Mario. No, oh, I guess I did. Whoopsie. Thank you for letting me know. That would have been confusing. Demolish Mosh. There we go. <laughs> Thank you. I would have totally missed that and I would have woken up tomorrow and been very confused. Awesome. See, this is why I have you guys. What's the boo command? It's not a thing anymore. Uh, I had it. Uh, I had commands like that for Halloween, but they're gone now. Uh, let's see here. So I have to move the museum down somewhere where it's not going to be in the way. Hey, so welcome back. I think I'll probably put it down here. Just right around this corner. No, this is what I was trying to avoid. <laughs> when it's cold, just yell real loud. It helps. Uh, let's talk. How's your Happy Home Academy score? Mine, um... Well, there weren't any touchdowns, that's for sure. Plus, I never even asked how many crunches I can do. See, the villagers sometimes talk as if they actually see when their homes are being evaluated, but we never do. Boots is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> very, very familiar dialogue by now. Thank you so very much for the follow. Welcome on in. <laughs> that quote. Pretty much, Phil. Pretty much. I accidentally talk to a villager, but you don't want to be rude and send them away. And then they ask for a favor. Oh god, yeah. Theory, can Boots wear boots? I think we gifted him boots a while ago. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, and he didn't end up putting them on. Yeah, I kind of want to keep Boots purely for that reason. He's my starter, even if he doesn't have, like, you know, a fancy house. Just to say that he's been with me since, you know, March 20th, you know? To be fair, Walker, I gave Boots a mask one time and he stuck it to the back of his head, so I don't know if he's gonna want to put Boots on the proper place. <laughs> he probably tried putting him on his hands. Which, you know, to each their own. <laughs> I'm not judging, I'm just saying. Okay, Boots, you can't be walking through this area right now, friend. Uh oh. Boots? Uh-oh. He'll be fine, right? <laughs> oh god. Put her sure saw mask on the back of her head? Yeah. There we go. This is generally a pretty safe area, I think. I don't think anything's gonna be going here. At least City Folk was popular. My siblings and I would log in at each other and rob each other's houses when we weren't around. Oh wow. <laughs> I'm kind of glad I didn't have siblings who played the game with me, to be honest. I would have gotten upset at that. That's funny though. Mm. 
There we go. That's a lot of uh, flowers moved. I don't know what I'm going to do with all my trees. I might actually just get rid of them again. <laughs> But this is a pretty good start for now. You guys, I think... I think now's actually a probably pretty good time to wrap up stream for the day. I am happy that I made it until just around 3 o'clock, which is when I'd normally wrap up anyway. Um, I do want to thank you all so very much for watching, though. If you guys are new and you enjoyed... So sure, are you feeling alright? <laughs> uh, and you enjoyed the randomness that you saw here today. It's usually not quite like this. I'm just under the weather today. Um... Feel free to drop that follow. I do stream usually every day except for Friday. Tomorrow is bug snacks. I'll tweet out uh, if I won't be live, but as far as I know, unless I'm feeling worse, I'll be live. <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to have a bit of a nap, I think. And uh, yeah, we'll see you all next time. Have a good rest of your day, everyone. <laughs>